ओके जो 24 साल में नहीं हुआ था वो आज हो रहा है टू ईयर्स आई वॉज नॉट टॉकिंग सो टोटली ट्वेंटी सिक्स ईयर्स सो हैव यू ऑल सीन द नेस्ट कैफे एड वेर अबाउट कमेडियन स्टैंड अप कॉमेडियन हु स्टैमस एवरी टाइम इज फिक्स सो वॉट इट डज इज ही यूज इज बिगेस्ट डिसएडवांटेज टू मेक इट अ फोकल पॉइंट ऑफ ए सक्सेस so i am here today to use one of my biggest disadvantage and that is facing random people fear of facing random people as my focal point to reach where i want to be hi good afternoon toastmasters this is himant acharya and i am here to give my feeble speech yes i'm a go yaar <laughs> okay this is so easy so easy to speak in front of the mirror right yeah so let me take you back uh, chronologically 25 years 26 years i was born on the year of 88 uh, in a place called uh, trivandrum kerala so on a cold diwali night and i remember my mom uh, telling me that uh, there was this huge celebration everywhere there was this uh, crackers burning and uh, you know all this joy and pompous everywhere and uh, I remember my I remember telling my mom that um, yeah that was during my birth I'll make sure that during my death there won't be so much of celebration <laughs> so I'm uh, every day I'm trying to make that you know I make an effort you know towards that goal so that people don't enjoy my death yeah so after that I traveled somewhere around 500 to 600 miles away to a place called Shimoga where I did my started my education and uh, and i moved to a place called a step uh, place called as udupi that's my hometown and i completed my rest of my education even including my engineering and i started my it career as well there so in all this time what happened was uh, i was channelized to towards a predictable path i mean in the school i was put in a good school and rat mark ke pad lo and get highest marks i did that and i got a good score and i was put directly from there to pc and there again the same uh, idea that mark ke padlo and get the best marks okay i got again distinction yeah so i thought i am on good path so then i moved i was put in a good college engineering college i went there again same thing the same what are you saying that is to get good marks and put yourself in a good position in society so what happened after four four years in engineering i am in it yeah and i thought that's the greatest thing to happen i saw 4gb ram computers right i mean <laughs> and i3 processors during my first days i was like dude that's it i am in the best place possible for 6 months 6 months one year I just went away and then on again i came to know that it is just the predictable thing that i am in again so there is nothing new because why i'm saying because i remember copying the same code from the same site in three different companies including oracle <laughs> <laughs> i mean it's the same code i copied from the same site and that is stack overflow for all the developers <laughs> and it's the same question yeah so that's it again the predictable way so what happened was uh, four years down the line i'm seeing myself doing nothing but same copy and paste and i just got frustrated with that and has signals to see think the same today that that dream and you have to you know deviate from your way to reach your destination so i thought let me you know thanks for the green card i don't know yeah so i thought i'll uh, break my way and the best way to do it is i thought according to me is facing people and completely random people and making your mark there because i believe that human beings are the most unpredictable the most unassuming and you know they are completely random so understanding them and speaking in front of them and making a mark is the greatest achievement that you can ever make so i decided to step on that uh, platform and that's the reason i chose toastmasters i thought this is a great place to be where i can meet some random people and make my mark and convince them you know ultimately i want to sell myself so i thought this is the best place to start because five or six or five or five to 10 years down the line i see myself doing a lot of this stuff so i want to be prepared for that 
So I thought, why not start in Toastmasters? And that's why I'm here today. And uh, thanks for the airlock again. <laughs> and, and yeah, that's it. Thanks for giving me this opportunity to break the ice. I think the ice is broken. <laughs> There's nothing else to break. <laughs> yeah, so thank you. And I hope I get keep, I, I keep getting opportunities like this so that I keep breaking more things than ice. Yeah, thank you. What do you talk about?